Hi all folks, this is Max from droidracerroot.com. So um, I'm going to go to my parents' house today. And um, Last time I brought my Droid Bionic, but it went over the um, 2 gigabyte limit. So it went over and then they charged me an extra $10 for going over and then I stopped using it. Um, but since I, ha I have a uh, grandfather plan here, unlimited, so I'm going to root and get Wi-Fi tethered um, so I can get it all free. Um, so to do this, go to menu settings, um, go to applications, and development. Make sure USB debugging is checked on like that. All right, and once that's done, um, connect your USB cable to your computer. Right now it's for Windows only, but I'll have instructions on how to do it for uh, Linux and Mac next week. Um, so let's do this. Let's go to our computer. And go download uh, droidrazerroot.zip. Um, also, you'll have to have uh, Motorola drivers installed um, for Windows. If you don't have it installed, um, you can download the file. I'll have the link below. And you can verify that you have drivers installed by going to Control Panel, Harbor and Sound, Device Manager. And you should see uh, something like this, Moto Composite ADB Device, or something similar. Anything with ADB will work fine. Um, so once that's done, just run uh, runme.bat, and you'll see the screen, and just hit enter. And it'll start, um, it'll start uh, rooting it. Also, I forgot to uh, point out you you'll want to um, you want to make sure it's in uh, USB connection is charge only mode like there, right? Make sure you have it on charge only, otherwise it will not work. Um, I will move this over here so you can see better the process. Oh, it's working, and it's gonna doing something. It's rebooting. Um, you can see it's installing BusyBox, uh, it installs Super User, um, so hopefully after reboot we should have a, a fully rooted Droid Razor. Um, by the way, this does not do anything to your system, it only gives you root, unlike other rooting methods for other Android phones. Um, so you have nothing to worry about, you just get root. Um, getting rid of root is pretty easy to do which I'll have a video about also um, so we should have a fully rooted phone so I can be on my way and get free 4G LTE tethering by the way 4G LTE is the fastest 4G um, in the US right now and probably worldwide too I know in South Korea everybody's moving from HSPA plus to uh, LTE already um, so I'm gonna just check it out real quick. Let me zoom in for the moment of truth. It's gonna be pretty fun here. Focus. Go to apps. Do we have super user? We have super user. Yes, we do. We have super user. All right. So I gotta root it. Uh, I'm gonna try to run set CPU, which uses uh, root, and it should ask you for super user uh, permissions yes that means my phone has been rooted okay my next video will be on how to get free Wi-Fi tether um, I am thinking it's probably same as um, Droid Bionic so we'll see anyway thanks y'all subscribe I have more tips don't forget to subscribe to my email list um, I'll have the links below here on YouTube and also my site um, so you'll be updated whenever there's new um, hacks, updates, tips for the Droid Razor, which would be like maybe once a month, maybe twice, or once a week maybe. So I highly suggest you um, sign up for it. And thanks y'all, and I just rooted my phone in like just what, two minutes. And thanks to the guys, that, um, the guys who made this. Thank you, see y'all later.